what is going on everybody it is sunday december 11th 2022 in big bear lake california it's 12 21 in the morning so we just started getting a little precipitation it's, there's nothing even on the radar like not even close it's supposed to start at about five or six in the morning but when i just pulled out of my driveway i slid all the way across the road and i was like what's going on do i have a flat tire or something like but no i was sliding so just uh I think we're getting some like freezing rain right now. This is like the, this. This would be the most dangerous conditions to drive in, you guys. You don't want to drive in conditions like this. But yeah, so we're getting a little drizzle, a little frozen precipitation. Oh my gosh, it is slick, you guys. I'm barely touching anything, and I'm all over the road. This is this is actually kind of kind of scary. So we're not gonna do much in terms of this drive right now. But yeah, it is, we are getting a little, a few, a few snow flurries. And I am gonna integrate this GPS eventually, guys, on every video that I do. So I think I'm gonna have to record this GPS as well with a different camera and then merge them together. So that's what I'm gonna have to do, but holy crap, guys! Once again, this is this is scary. This uh, this these roads are horrible right now, and it just started literally five minutes ago. Sliding right now, jeez. Those of you who've been watching this channel a long time, you know I'm really good at this. I never use tire chains. That's just me. It's not smart, but I never use tire chains gonna take any of these turns hard at all seriously this freezing rain type of stuff is horrible wow yeah I wish I was recording when I pulled out of the driveway because it was like a weird sensation I just kept sliding across and across and across barely hit the gas at all yeah, anyway, I'm going to get on my phone to get the weather forecast right now to show you guys what it's looking like on the radar. Okay, now it's showing a little bit. It may show up about 2.30. Look, so this is what that's showing right there. And then in, in terms of the... Wow, now all of a sudden there's stuff showing up on the radar in our area, let me zoom in here. So where that little arrow is, and that blue spot behind the arrow, that's us. So that is what is happening here. We're just gonna take this route by Bear Mountain. So let's just see, I'm gonna hit the gas a little bit. And just. Oh man, guys, it is bad. I've never been slipped as much as I'm slipping right now, ever, since I've lived up here. That's why it's really important that we get some good snowfall to fall because uh, my tires will be eating at the snow, gripping a little better because I do have good snow tires on this bad boy. Not all-terrain tires, not with, not just uh, all-season tires. These are snow tires. I'm going to turn right here. I'm going to let this guy go ahead, actually. There we go. Careful, buddy. I'm telling you, this is really slippery. We're gonna let him go ahead. He's hauling butt. But yeah, so uh, this is where we're at. We're in Moon Ridge right now. We just passed Bear Mountain. Um, the roads are hairy right now. Not fun. But you guys know what I do. As soon as we get any change in weather, I'm out here. And as I, uh, I've been looking at the radar all night long and it kept on pushing it off and pushing it off and pushing it off. There was nothing until maybe five or six in the morning. But I've been staring out the window this whole time and I saw some precipitation. So I thought, you know what, we're gonna, we're gonna go get this handled. So that'll be cool that we got something on, on, on camera before tomorrow. Okay, this next, these next couple turns are gonna be horrible. So 
seriously, those of you who know me know how I drive and know how, how well I do in, the, in these conditions. You must understand, this is, if this is hairball for me, I know it's gonna be really scary for a lot of people. Dude, we're sliding right there. Jeez Louise. Jeez Louise. Slow down, Nick. I'm only going 22 miles an hour, but that's still too fast for me right now. It's picking up a little bit. I don't know if you can see down by the by the headlights, but it is definitely picking up. Temperature has dropped down to 31. So it's still looking like today, since it's technically Sunday, today we still could get um, by probably two or three o'clock PM, maybe eight to 12 inches. I really hope that's the case. I really hope that's the case. Yeah, I'm still tripping on when I pulled out of the driveway. I've never felt anything like that up here. Because literally it just started to come down and it's, it's super light. It's picking up right now, but it's super light and it just had started. And right when I came out of the driveway going about this fast, it just wouldn't turn. It just kept sliding across the road and kept sliding across the road. I was thinking, wonderful, here we go. Gonna crash my new car now. So we're coming through the roundabout area again. It's so lit up now. All these lights on both sides and in the middle are all brand new. It used to be very dark driving down this street at night. Now it's like daytime here. All right, so we're gonna do a snow summit drive-by and then we're gonna go drive through the village and then come back. Temperature's back up to 32. Good to see you all. Hope you all are having a great night, getting ready for all this weather. It's gonna be a tiring situation for me, I can already tell. Because I went to sleep for a couple hours earlier, hoping that I would uh, be able to uh, get some rest before five or 6 a.m. What is this? All right. Oh, snowplow. All right. We're going to turn left here. Holy moly, we're sliding. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Seriously, that's crazy. I'm not used to that. Hang on a second, guys. Okay, sorry about that. That was the wife checking in on me. It's 12.30 a.m. When she falls asleep, she falls asleep. And so uh, she didn't know where I was and it scared her. <laughs> poor thing. My poor baby. I was like, baby, I was, I was asking you if you want to go and you can sleep in the car. and But you were too tired to go. So we're coming up to uh, Summit Boulevard pretty quickly here. We cross one more street called Crestwood and then the next main street will be Summit. And we are gonna go check out Summit for a minute. Look at the sky, guys. Isn't that unbelievably beautiful? Every time we get snowstorms, it seems like the clouds from the snowstorms reflect so much light and it just makes the sky look gorgeous. Especially when we get like heavy, heavy snow. It seems like it's really bright outside. I love it. When I lived in Denver, Colorado, when I was 14 and 15, I was sent to a boarding school in Denver, Colorado for two years. I got to come back a lot and visit my mom and stuff like that, but I lived like in Denver. And so there's a lot of city lights and whatnot. And uh, when it would snow, it was so bright outside. I loved it absolutely loved it the cool thing about my boarding school is that i got to choose what state i wanted to go to boarding school in 
I didn't get to choose whether I went to boarding school or not, but because I loved the snow my whole life, I chose a place like Colorado because I figured it would have some really good snow. And I wasn't wrong. All right, here we go. We're on Summit Boulevard. We're gonna hang a lefty. Oh my gosh, look at this. We're sliding like crazy. Look at that. Guys, holy moly, I'm going two miles an hour sliding. This is horrible. This is horrible, my friend. Everything is going to be okay. All right. It's so beautiful. Oh my gosh, this is so beautiful. We're, we're kind of gonna kind of go in the back way here. We're going the wrong way, but there's no one here. Oh my gosh, this these, this road is like it's giving me trouble just going up this little hill. This is insanity, guys. Look at how beautiful that is. Just magnificent. And... This, what on earth is that? Don't run into my car, please. Don't run into my car. Oh my gosh, I'm sliding again. This is nutty, you guys. This is, this is freezing rain. This, this is literally the worst conditions to possibly drive in. It's horrible for power lines too. Yeah, this is not good. This needs to transition sooner than later because uh, this is dangerous. Oh my gosh, I'm sliding right now. I know I'm complaining a lot right now, but holy moly, this is not good. Okay, we're gonna take off. We're gonna leave to the other side of Snow Summit here of the park. Oh my goodness. Thank goodness this isn't during the day because there would be so many accidents right now. I'm sliding still. I'm sliding again. <laughs> We would have so many accidents right now. Unbelievable. Oh my gosh. Like I can't even steer. All right, slow down, Nikki. Now we're gonna go down this kind of a steep hill. I'm super nervous. Oh my gosh. Guys, like this is horrible. You hear that? My brakes, I have my brakes completely uh, we're gonna go in a lower gear. Now we're in first gear. Oh my gosh, this is scary. I would hate to crash in these conditions. Just tap the brakes, dude. Just tap, give it a little tap. Tap, tap, tap a -roo. You know what, guys? We're going to avoid the village right now. We're just going to go back home. I've, like, never been so scared on these roads, even when there's three feet of snow out there. Oh, my gosh. This is terrifying. Slow down, Nick. I'm going, like, 17 now, but it feels like we're going 275. All right. This is just horrible. I know you guys probably think I'm BSing. I'm telling you the truth. This is tripping me out right now. This guy's kind of stuck spinning, spinning straight in front of us too. We made it down the steep part. And we're gonna have to start to apply the brakes all the way back here. Just pump on the brakes very lightly. You don't want to go through these stop signs. And these are conditions that you'll go right through the stop sign. Even at this speed, this is really horrible. So we're gonna get into the middle lane here. Yeah, I'm not liking this at all.
guys, just so you know, there's never any rush up here. So don't ever be in a hurry. Just be, be excited that you're up here to have a good time and go skiing and play in the snow and stuff like that. Build snowmen, go sledding, all that stuff. Do not be in a hurry. These conditions will make you have a horrible vacation. Keeping my eyes on the road, car. The car's talking smack to me, telling me to keep my eyes on the road. I'm sliding again. Holy smokes. All right, so there's no cars coming up here to the right of me, so we're gonna turn right from the center lane here. I'm doing what I can to be as safe as I can for our situation right now. change my underwear that was hairy all right this turn gets people all the time too i see cars spun out right right after this little like we're doing right now oh my god i'm not trying to switch lanes look i got pushed over into this lane anyway guys i love you so much this is the slipperiest ever since i've lived here you guys take care. I love you very, very much. Thanks for being here for me. You guys take care. I'm off. Woohoo!